All right, so recently I took a very exciting delivery, which was obviously my Elvis frame. And I also was talking to some bottom bracket people and managed to get my hands on an absolute revolutionary product, the SM Bataille bottom bracket. Now, you may have seen me sort of promoting this on my Instagram and all the rest of it, but I thought let's give it an actual review and why I'm using it and why I think it's gonna be really good. So first of all, just do a little unboxing. So it comes in a nice little tin, rate that. Um, there's lots of parts, so this is all for the, the pressing thing. This is the bottom bracket itself, but we'll, we'll get into that a little bit in a, in a minute. This is also for sorting it out. And then you've got the two, sorry, got the two end caps. Um, so basically it's all like solid metal bearings either side, both of these are NTM, which is the good stuff. Uh, and then it's a BB-86 My one, so the, the usual standards. Um, now the main reason you have one of these bottom brackets is that obviously if you've got a frame that isn't perfect, it can eliminate like the misalignment with the holes, um, which ca can cause um, a lot of noise and creaking, which is never good. The Elves doesn't suffer from that, um, but the, the other main advantage as well is that you can obviously take out um, the bearings and replace them, so you don't have to take out the whole bottom bracket. You can just take out the bearings, which is really, really good. Um, and can often increase, uh, like, what well, basically decreases the amount of resistance you have because um, it's a one piece design. So there's not going to be like the when the interface in the middle of it, if it's misaligned, you can get more friction and things like that. Um, James Shaw, the big boy himself, has been using that with a seventh in the Tour of Norway. Um, so it definitely works. Um, and it's an absolute top grade bottom bracket, in my opinion. Um, I mean, obviously, we haven't put it on the bike yet. It's going to be exciting to put it on the bike um, and see how it is. Now, it's quite a new brand, SM Bataille. Um, so at a moment, it's a bit hard to get your hands on it, but um, I was talking to the owner, Phil, and he's basically said next couple of weeks or so, maybe um, on a month, um, it should be up and ready to go on the website. Um, now you might have seen these similar to sort of Hambini style. Apparently he didn't actually invade it. It was a BB Infinite who came up with a one piece design. Obviously Hambini chats a lot of stuff about his um, in, in comparison of like he mills it all himself. Um, this is also milled in the UK as well. Uh, which is good to know uh, and I guess the main thing when you buy it, like a bottom bracket that isn't from like a big brand is the person who's making it um, and it, this I mean Phil is very experienced knows what he's doing and all the rest of it so it should be an absolute top product it also comes with some nice stickers um, which is Seek uh, but yeah that's the initial thing it looks like a solid piece um, just a quick note on installation we'll do a full video on installation but I thought you know we'll give a couple tips just don't put these on until the end and if I was you, I'd probably get someone else to do it unless you're very good with bike mechanics because if you mess it up, not ideal. Um, but yeah, apart from that, that's more more or less the, the deets. Um, made of alloy, one piece bottom bracket. Once you whack it in, um, then put the dust caps on at the end. Change the bearings when you need to. Jobs, life's good. Um, so yeah, excited to put this on the bike, see how it is. Because um, my bike came with one of those weird ones where like it's a bottom bracket for BB-86 but your thread's in. 10 out of 10 would not recommend that. Um, that's gonna come on my Elves review, which is gonna come out soon. I wanna put this on first, just so I actually get a proper bottom bracket on, and then, um, and then you know, give it a little, a little bit more a little bit more of a test. I mean, I've ridden the Elves about 1,000 Ks, and it's pretty good, um, but it'll be good to have like a proper BB in and see what the difference is. So anyway, cheers for watching, hope you did enjoy. Um, I'm gonna leave all the details to SM Vitae below, um, so definitely check out our website and all the rest of it, and um, we'll see you in the next one.